DJ. You were fabulous today. Today was his icebreaker. He was supposed to begin to practice his speaking skills to get comfortable. The point of an icebreaker is to help us get to know you. And everybody does that differently. But right away, I know I can trust you. I know that you're a very likable gentleman with a wonderful smile. I know that you're a very peaceful individual and you have a great sense of humor. What else do I need to know? <laughs> that was just a great way to do an icebreaker. I wish it had lasted forever. It was only five minutes. I was surprised. It seemed like it was about two minutes and it was over. But I loved your opening. It was humorous right from the very beginning. They say that if you can get a laugh out of a crowd in the first few seconds, you've got them, and you did. And you kept the humor throughout. I love how you told the story about the job, the job search, job, the job, the job, and that had humor just in and of itself. But coming across the spiritual leader was really interesting. I was intrigued by that. And I would have really liked to have learned a little bit more about how he touched you, how he connected with you, and how you took that and worked with it, I think that was the only suggestion that I would have on tell me more. And that's great when you can want me to want to hear more. You asked me to check on your pace and your pronunciation. I thought your pace was perfect. It was not too fast. But I thought every now and then a word was hard to understand. It wasn't the whole sentence. It was just like you tune out for just a single word. And you might get a coach or a tape recorder to see which words that those were, because it was just occasional ones, and I can't even tell you which one it was, maybe six of them. But I would work on that only. But the rest of it, I mean, you were very clear. It was very easy to understand. I think that the one thing that you proved today is that there are certain things that are incompatible with fear, and that is your smile and your peaceful demeanor and your humor. And those three things, if you have those in any speech, you cannot possibly stand up here and be afraid. You will win that audience over. I thought your, your lack of notes, your body language was very open.